Today we're going to learn a song called Liza Jane, and we're also going to learn the new concept of playing with a new finger, which is your pinky finger, or what we refer to as fourth finger. So I'm going to come here close so you can understand this concept. So up to this point we've always done with scales, open, first finger, second finger, third finger. Now normally from here we always play the next open, so E, but we can also play that particular note with a four instead of open. So we can go, that pitch should match the open string. See that? So now um, the biggest thing with the fourth finger is all fundamentals, doing fundamentals correctly. So most students what they do is they try to reach for the fourth finger. Now notice when I do that, my hand comes along with it. So what you gotta do is you gotta have your hand up at this position like we've been working on getting knuckles up and then just lay your pinky flat and make sure it's on that particular angle. So don't try to reach it, just try to just lay it out there. It's okay if it touches other strings. It's like that. Very good. All right, so we're going to apply this to the song Liza Jane. Starts off on second finger on the A string. Open A. Now here comes your fourth finger. Make sure you match this pitch. dotted half note. There's a four. Very good. All right, let's try that up to sp uh, a little faster. Very good. All right, so you're probably wondering, well, uh, what, what is the purpose behind playing fourth finger when I can just play the open string? So, good question. Uh, the answer to that would be, we want to eliminate crossing strings as much as we can while playing the violin. So you're going to find a lot of places that are going to um, um, aid in that with using a fourth finger. Also, um, when we do double stops in the future, uh, playing two strings at once, we're going to want to play a four with another note. So it's very important to develop that finger, but it's very weak um, if you've never used it before. So normally it takes a couple weeks to kind of get the hang of it and be able to reach it comfortably. So work on that for at least a week, I would say, and then move on to the next lesson.